Hi everyone, I'm Nick from Pace Invoice. We do multi-currency invoicing and local payment collections for small businesses. But I'll explain a bit more about that during my presentation. I'd like, you I'd like to take you back to the Hilton case study that James gave you. We improved the invoice delinquency rates by 70% and took one key learning away from that experience. That the easier you make it for your international clients to pay you, the quicker you get paid. And in a world where cash flow is king, that's gold dust. Hilton didn't become a global brand by mistake. They looked after their customer needs and in much the same way, small businesses have to do the same. But there's a problem. Imagine the plight of a small business owner sat at your desk, having to do things manually or managing multiple unconnected accounts and software solutions. It feels like your hands are tied, it's debilitating and the effects can be dramatic. So dramatic, in fact, that over half of small businesses get paid late. A quarter of small businesses feel a fear of closure over cash flow issues, and 90% of money managers admit to not having a clear picture of their cash flow at any point in time. With those horror stats in mind, what small business would not want a solution that improved late payments by over 70% and improved administrative efficiencies by over 80%? That's exactly what Pace has done for Hilton and exactly what we want to do for every small business client that we look after. During our time at Startup Bootcamp, we validated our proposition with dozens and dozens of small businesses, one of which was Smarter, an amazing high-tech digital company that had cornered a segment of the UK market and was now going global. They just landed their first contract with L'Oreal in the US. But when I met Carolyn, she had her head in her hands. They just delivered a flawless project and now faced an absolute nightmare getting paid. She had raised two invoices, one in sterling, which promptly got rejected, followed by a dollar invoice, which got paid by dollar check. Does anybody know how long it uh, take, does anybody know how long it takes to cash a foreign currency check in the UK? Up to three months. So forget the fact that smarts have lost over 10% of the value of that transaction. Three months can mean the difference between life or death for a small business. And we don't think that's right. At Pace Invoice, we believe SMEs deserve better. So in a single dashboard, you can access real-time multi-currency accounts where you can raise invoices, collect funds, and make international payments seamlessly. This is all underpinned by an international banking footprint and local alternative payment methods which make the journey for your clients paying you a familiar one and ensuring you get paid quicker. If we take a look at the total addressable market, it runs into the trillions, but that's just not realistic. The UK European trading corridor alone has over 600,000 small business exporters. 96% of those exporters export into the EU. And that means hundreds of billions in flows one way only. How do we propose to monetize this amazing opportunity? Well, in the short term, we make money on FX. And in the mid to long term, cash flow financing, amongst other things, comes into play. We have over 20 small businesses ready to go live in our new platform launch in December and a number of channel partners, one of which we've contracted and doubles our turnover alone in 2017 on the existing flows that we're dealing with. We're also in discussions with Avato Bertelsmann to land a pilot with them early into next year, which will see us handling flows of close to 100 million euros. As you can see, Rails Bank, who are down the line, we're also going to be one of their launch partners, and we built out against Nigel's previous company, the Currency Cloud. From a timing perspective, we could not be in a better position. Startup Bootcamp has given us access to all of the major banks that you see over there. We're in advanced conversations with a number of them, and we're also part of the DIT's Global Entrepreneur Program. Together, the Department for International Trade and the five major high street banks have signed a government charter to create 100,000 new first-time exporters by 2020 with a particular focus on digital technology. And we, ladies and gentlemen, are that digital technology. There are competitors in the market, but they either focus on FX and payments outbound, or they do collections via cloud accounting or rudimentary invoicing tools. Pace Invoices does both seamlessly. And by the way, I mentioned these as competitions. Many of them are channel partners as well. As a founding team, we have 35 years combined experience across FX and payments. We've worked together in the past. And when James met George, our awesome CTO, 
he had just finished building Money Corp's global payment system, a platform which today handles flows in excess of 15 billion pounds. So from a tech perspective, we punch way above our weight category. Behind us, we have some amazing investors and advisors, banking experts, payment specialists, fintech gurus and technologists in their own right. And today we sit in front of you, our audience, looking for small businesses that need to get paid smarter and quicker, channel partners that want to take a solution to their clients that's going to keep them sticky, and investors who want to get involved in our fundraising in Q1 2017. If anyone's got any questions, please fire away. Thank you.